Okay, looking back at this thing after it dried, I'm a little bit more pleased with it. I, uh, you see where we actually brought it up? There. This is just something different. Yeah, it's just a different type hairstyle. I can wear it more like it's right here. Every hit it looks a little different on so that's the whole thing here. Just a nice look. We'd actually come back in thin a little more if we want to. I think he wanted to look it goes around like that. If he'd want to dress up or something, put on a suit, something boy, it would look sharp. If you want to go out on a you know, a date or something. <laughs> Any woman have you now? <laughs> they will. <laughs> oh, yeah. You ain't that old, are you? Not that old yet. Okay. You can kind of see what this looks like. So, kind of faded hairline. Come in here and. Uh, uh, so, unique look. It's pretty sharp. Okay. Thanks, bro. So what we're doing here, we're coming in here and we are doing this fade. We'll take it out with a one, probably a one-eighth blade. Uh, what I consider being a one. I'm going to ease up here a little bit on it. Uh, I like to fade this in. Really what they did back then is just fade it right in. Bend your head down a little bit, Wayne. Okay. Just fade this right in. You see what I'm doing here? I'm just fading this right in. Uh, that's basically what they did years ago. They did the fades more than they did the, the hairlines, I believe, back in the 20s and 30s. Just a more of a military type look, a neat look. Real clean looking haircut. That's what we're doing here. Gonna come in here and do this a little bit. Oh, uh, okay, but one. I'm gonna come in here and just take this out a little bit. I'm just gonna kind of ease up to where I want it at to get the feel of it. And, that, and really, that's what you do. Always save yourself something to work with. Then you won't be caught with a cut it too short in the wrong places. Get some of this out of the way. So you can see the it's taking on the characteristics of this haircut already. And you can see what we're doing there. Okay? It's taking on that characteristics. And this this like I say, this cut looks good when you dress up. At any time if you keep it keep it looking neat. But when they put on they dress up just a little bit, it really looks neat. Hey man, give me a minute, we'll be with you. Turn this side here. these up a little higher. It's not everybody that's going to come in and ask for one of these haircuts. I don't believe that. It just takes a special type person that really will step outside the box a little bit and go ahead and do it. Uh, it's become more popular in this area lately. 
if you notice on a lot of the movies, they always come up with something a little bit snazzier. Uh, something unique for the time period that stands out, something different than what we're doing. I might put a few streaks in your hair as we get this crowd out of here. If you're going to hang around here a little bit. Okay. Uh, I'll do a little bit with some color. All right. Go back to my roots a little bit here and show people what we do with that. And, uh, something to be interesting. Maybe they'll learn something. Uh, I don't think it's unmasculate for a man to do hair color because they were some of the first ones that did it and developed it. And were. I'm going to dry this a little bit. I'm going to probably come up a little higher with this. I say every head of hair is just a little different. You've got to come in here and work with it. Just a little bit to know what to do with it. this out some by doing some of this. Yeah, just slightly. Do want to come in here and just play a little bit. A little gel. It's going to take something to really put this in place.
preferably a head of hair that stays closer to the scalp than this one does would be better. But still, you just have to develop it for its style. For the edge. Back here thin. Don't never pick up the wrong shears for this job. Pick up the regular shears you got up yesterday. We might come in and fade his in a little bit later on, but this is going to be the Michael Pitt. I'm probably going to do something else on him. But as far as his hair, just being a little extra bushy here on this, but uh, uh, you can kind of see what it looks like. And if you got the hair that lays down for it, it's a little better. But you can kind of see what's going on here. Let me uh, fade this around the ears here. Come down on the sides. Take the Got us a land, that's kind of your look you want to go with. Land down more like that. He's got a little cowlick here, so we're probably going to end up fading his a little different. But you can see this cut how I actually did it. Now, preferably, I want to point it a little bit more here and have a little long and fullness, more fullness in here for this style. So, didn't have it quite full enough, but I might actually come in and do him a faded haircut later. But you can actually see this video. Thanks for coming to our channel. I'm Michael Cassidy. Thanks for subscribing to us. Thank you. Okay, looking back at this thing after it dried. I'm a little bit more pleased with it. I, uh, you see where we actually brought it up? There. This is just something different. You know, just a different type of hairstyle. I can wear it more like it's right here. Every hit it looks a little different on so let's hold the thing here. Just a nice look. We'd actually come back in thin a little more if we want to. I think he more to look. It goes around like that. If he want to dress up or something, put on a suit, something boy, it would look sharp. If you want to go out on a you know, a date or something. <laughs> Any woman have you now? <laughs> <We'll>, <laughs> oh, yeah. You ain't that old, are you? Not that old yet. Okay. You can kind of see what this looks like. So, kind of faded hairline. Come in here and. Uh, so, unique look. It's pretty sharp. Okay. Thanks, bro.